Star appearance for James Harden here, but first for Team Stefan. <laughs> what you guys talk about? What do you? What's the uh, vibe from Team Stefan? We got a very competitive team, man. So we want to win. You know, I mean, it's an all-star game. Maybe a lot of threes, a lot of dunks, but ultimately we want to win. So uh, that was our, our game plan of locker room. I know this is not new to you, but it's new to a guy like Joel Embiid. What do you want him to? In, what do you want him to enjoy and see this weekend in his first? Have fun. Have fun. Embrace it. You know, uh, I know it's. Especially his first year, it's a lot going on, but when he get, comes to the game, have fun, enjoy it, and just show your skills, show why you're in the game. And James, you guys have had a great first half, best record in the league, and you get Joe Johnson and Brandon Wright for the stretch drive. So you got to be feeling pretty confident right now. We're, uh, we're excited, man, just to add those two guys to what we've already, already been doing. Uh, it's a great feeling. And obviously, we know who we're going against, and so uh, depth is very important. Uh, for these last 25 games and going into the postseason, so uh, yeah, we'll be ready. What do you think of the young guys coming in with the dancing when the intro, in the intro? That's fun, man. It's just a blessing. They get an opportunity to actually, you know, hang around us and dance and catch a vibe. Uh, that's pretty dope. James, thanks for your time, man. Enjoy the week. Appreciate you, D.A. All right. Back to you, Matt. <laughs> Thank you, D.A. I mentioned uh, James Harden is the leading candidate. That's an opinion, obviously, but I think it's an opinion shared by most people who cover and, and observe the NBA.